A triple suicide bomb attack on a police headquarters in central Damascus has killed two people and injured six others. It's the second bombing this month on the Syrian capital claimed by self-styled Islamic State, or ISIL, which experts say is a response to its multiple defeats elsewhere. U.S.-backed forces are said to be on the verge of ousting the militants from the city of Raqqa, one of their last strongholds. Kurdish troops were at the forefront of the offensive, which began in early June. Up to 400 militants are believed to remain in a small part of the city, among them foreign fighters who are expected to fight to the death. As the campaign to drive out Islamic State from western Syria eastwards to the Iraqi border continues, thousands of civilians are being displaced. Shelling and clashes have swelled refugee camps in Deir al-Zor province downriver from Raqqa. At one south of al asaka organizers said overcrowding and lack of services and tents was making life intolerable for around 27,000 people.